90% of the people I interact with don't know that we don't have sea otters on the Oregon coast. Sea otters have been missing from the Oregon coast for over 100 years. We want to bring them back. Why? Because they're a really critical part of our coastal environment. The sea otters, they're really the guardians of the kelp. By being present, they allow these kelp forests to flourish. Kelp is like the trees in the forest, except in the ocean. Kelp forests are home to a large variety of species, from tiny mycid shrimp to the huge gray whales that feed upon them. They provide habitat for all sorts of fish, and they capture carbon from the atmosphere. And if we lose our kelp forests, we lose a huge way that we can mitigate the impacts of climate change. Sea otters like to eat sea urchins, and by eating the sea urchins, they control that population. If there were no sea otters, which there aren't today, those sea urchins will run wild and mow down all of the kelp forests. We know without them right now, we're losing kelp. We have kelp forests that are in crisis. So the Ilaka Alliance is an idea. It's the idea that we can bring sea otters back to Oregon. The Alaka Alliance is a coalition of scientists, tribes, coastal communities, and interested citizens. Restoring sea otters is all about the ecosystem and the legacy of the future, but it's also about repairing the past and restoring a very strong relationship between indigenous people and sea otters. The first thing we needed to do was to understand whether this was even possible. What we were able to do was bring together a group of world-class scientists and experts in sea otter biology, ecology, um, socioeconomics, and what the study shows us is that reintroducing sea otters to Oregon is biologically feasible, and that is a very big Deal. We're reintroducing sea otters into a world that's very different from when they were last here. The ocean is a much busier place, and so we need to be very vigilant that we work with those who will be affected. We have the science that says that we can do it. Now we need to figure out if we will do it and where we will do it. The Oregon coast belongs to everybody. By bringing sea otters back, it gives people hope that they can contribute to the future that their children and their grandchildren will occupy. It's really a gift to everyone, regardless of where they live, what political party they're in, everybody likes to see the wildness and experience that. Bringing sea otters back means restoring our coastal environments, making them more resilient for fisheries, for recreation, for tourism, that make Oregon a wonderful place to live.